Hi, Cancer. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into this, Cancer. Thank you, God, for blessing Cancer with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so Cancer... Um, I've just had a brain fart. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> um, okay, Cancer. Uh, the situation this week, the Eight of Pentacles, okay? The advice for you is the Ten of Swords, okay? Um, I think Libra got the Ten of Swords, okay? And the outcome is the Three of Swords. So something is over, okay? Um... Cancer, you could have been keeping more than one option open or someone you're dealing with was, okay? And it looks like somebody is cutting out an option here, okay? Um, something wasn't going in a way that they thought it would go, that you thought it would go with the Eight of Pentacles, the Ten of Swords, and the Three of Swords. It's like... Um, some of you also trying to stay busy to really not deal with the fact that something is very hurtful. The ending of a situation, the ending of a relationship, um, how somebody has isolated you or you isolated them, There that there is no communication, there is no talking, there is no coming together. Um, you're trying to control your emotions and stay balanced about this, but you have a lot of uh, things you want to say. You have a lot of emotions pent up. You may even want to go to this person and um, be romantic with them. Something about somebody's holding out hope for you. Hope that, um, yeah, hope for you. Hope that, okay, hang on one second. All All right, so Cancer, it looks like somebody has to cut out one option to go to another. That's what the cards are really saying. And it, somebody may even have to go as far as to divorce. Um, they have to, you know, really sever a tie here, really let something be over. Um, something that they have been in for a very long time, maybe eight years, eight or more years, of something that was cyclical, like something that goes in and out, you know, off and on, hot and cold. This could be you, Cancer, you and another person. But it's like somebody is trying to cut out one person to, because they're holding out hope for another person to actually marry this person with wedding here. And then wife, knowing that there's some unresolved issues between this outside individual. The relationship started off rocky with surprise, but it says that somebody, um, the relationship would actually turn out very well because somebody is a sweetheart. Somebody is somebody's sweetheart. Someone is very nice, very caring, very open. Um, somebody feels like home to either you, Cancer, or vice versa, or it's mutual. But it's like before somebody can get all of this or go towards a particular person, they have to be done with maybe a, a third person, a third energy. Somebody has to divorce somebody or something or some way of life. Somebody can't cope with the fact that a relationship has ended. It's over, maybe an air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius can't cope with the fact that it is over, that it has ended, and therefore they want to they want to show back up. They want to show up right, or vice versa. This is you. Somebody just can't cope with the fact that this is done, and they're still holding out hope for that maybe it can be revived, it can be relived. The only thing I don't see happening is it's like somebody is going through the motions in their in their mind, knowing that something is like on the brink of actually really being over. So they're going through the emotions in their mind. They're really filtering their thoughts through their emotions, but they're not doing anything about it. 
again, holding out hope, knowing that there's unresolved issues, but not actually taking any action here. Somebody could be drinking a lot, trying to go out, hang out to actually escape from the fact that they miss something or miss someone or they missed an opportunity. Something about miss. Yeah, somebody really needs to go and talk to somebody about how they're, they're feeling, about how they want a new start with someone. And then somebody might just um, send a message, a letter, a text message. It's like, it's really like the inability to cope and get over. This could be you, Cancer. It could be another person. Also, this could be job loss too, or uh, lots of work that is going to lead maybe to collapse. Um, you need to check in on your health, health and well-being, especially um, your diet, um, diabetes. Uh, I don't know, something about your blood, blood work. Yeah, you might need to go to a doctor. If this is emotional stress, and then coupled with maybe work, you know, that could be very serious. So do check in with a physician. Do the work to get where you want to be. You have no major arcana here. So it's really all on you, Cancer, about where you want to be, what you want to be doing. This is what I have for you. If it resonates for you, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. Some of you could be having trouble focusing or you can't focus. Your mind wanders. I don't know. Um, you can ask a question by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy L or coffee link. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night here where I answer questions. And you can also just come for the collective reading. Thank you, Cancer. Many blessings to you. Take care.